Michael Cameron. How did your baseball team do yesterday? What a team. We won the playoffs. Good cool. job. The Comets are headed for the All-City Championship this Saturday. That's great. Would it make you nervous if we came and watched? No, I'd love the moral support. <laughs> uh, one of the things that's so great about you kids is the way you help each other. I wish there was a way to get across to your viewers how important it is. I'll try and think of a way to put that into the script. Thank you. I'd like that. Hey, guys, I brought you some muffins. Oh, I thank you. Just trying to keep my team happy. And well fed. That's true. Are you guys ready to make another show? Of course we are. Asa, roll the opening. Three, two, one, and take it. Cue the host. Good morning and welcome to the Kid Songs TV Show. The one and only show made by kids. For kids. And starring kids. Hi, I'm Tiffany Burton. And I'm Sergio Centeno. We have a wonderful show for you today filled with lots of great music videos. A very exciting guest. And... Bingo! I'm Billy. I'm the blue one. <laughs> and I like to play and sing and ask questions. <laughs> and I'm Ruby. Billy, I think our viewers know all about you already. I just wanted to be sure. I'm sure. Our first video of the day is a lot of fun to dance to. So come on in, Conga. keeps getting stuck. See, when I try to do a nice zoom into Tiffany, it goes all jerky. We'll get Cameron to come and fix it for you. Cameron, we need you on the floor right away. Lana, you're going to have to work with it for this next intro. I'll try. Hosts, we're coming to you in three, two, and cue. Our next video shows how nice it is when older kids spend time with their brothers and sisters. These kid songs, kids get along very well together. Ruby and I get along very well together, too. That makes our mom very happy. So let's check out these happy siblings in... Button Up Your Overcoat! Button Up Your Overcoat When the wind is free Take good care of yourself You belong to me
wrong, but it's going to take a few minutes to fix it. What should I do? Let's ask Troy to cover your shot for you on camera, too. I heard you. No problem. I've got it. What a team. And cue. Our next video stars some very talented Kid Songs kids. I can't believe how well these kids can jump rope. Check them out in Skip to My Lou. Lou, Lou, skip to my Lou. How's it going, Lana? I'm having a hard time finding information on harmonicas for Mimi's interview today. Okay, let me help you. Okay, so what have you found out so far? Just that there are two types of harmonicas. One you blow through to make a noise, and one that Ben Franklin invented a long time ago using water and glasses. Okay, so let's work on this. Okay. Lana, is your camera fixed? Sure is. Check out this beautiful zoom. Let's hear for Cameron. He's done it again. Thanks, Cameron. You're welcome. Cue the hus. Our next video shows the kids' songs boys and girls exhibiting their competitive streak. Yep, it was fierce at the arcade games. Let's see who was right when they said, Anything you can do, I can do better. I can do anything better than you. It's a lot of fun. It's easy to learn. Have a great beat. 
band is fun to dance to. Let's join my tuba playing friend, Booba Wooba John. Saw a tree, kick a tree. and Beethoven both wrote symphonies for the harmonica. Whoa, I'm surprised. It says here that in China they have an instrument called the sheng, which is almost the same as a harmonica. Wow, with a little bit of work, you'll find out so many fascinating things. How cool! What's up next? How does your garden grow? Oh good, I like this video. Then this one's for you. Cue them. The Kid Song's kids went to their friend Mary's beautiful garden and asked her for a gardening secret. Let's see what they found in... How does your garden grow? Very, very quiet contrary. How does your garden grow? All the flowers, all the colors, all in a perfect row. First the seeds and then the water, keeping a Your garden grow. Forget me nuts and marigolds tied up in a bow. Coral bells and golden rod standing up so tall. Baby's breath, candy tuck. for the interview, we're going to need more shots than I can get on my own. Sure. I like being the camera person. It's a cool job. Good. Host, it's all yours. Our next song is a traditional American folk song that goes back to the Old West. So let's head out and back in time and join the singing cowboy for Oh Susanna! I come from Alabama with Joe on my knee Born to Louisiana My true love for the sea Oh Susanna Why don't you cry for me I come from Alabama With a banjo on my knee it rained all night The day I left The weather it was dry The sun so hot I froze to death Susanna don't you cry Oh Susanna Why don't you cry for me Alabama with a banjo on my knee Oh Susanna, don't you cry for me Cause I come from Alabama with a banjo on my knee 
on my knee Cause I come from Alabama with banjo on my knee Hey! Don't even ask. I've got the graphic ready. <laughs> Why am I not surprised? Because you know you can count on me. <laughs> oh, brother. Okay, okay. We're just having some fun in here. Roll the question time, graphic. Three, two, one, and take it. And cue the host. And now it's time for the ever-popular question time part of our show. Featuring the magnificent Mimi Paley. Today, Mimi presents Bobby Joe Holman, a harmonica player extraordinaire. Did it take you a long time to learn how to play the harmonica well? Yes, a long time. I've been playing for 30 years. Why did you choose harmonicas? Because I like the sound of the harmonica, and it's the closest thing to the human voice. Did you always love music? Always. Since about five years old, I've been singing and playing. How old were you when you started playing? I started playing the harmonica when I was about 19 years old. Does it take a lot of practice? Oh, it does. You have to work at it every day, every chance that you get. I used to take it with me everywhere that I went and just take it out of my pocket and start practicing. Can you show us the harmonicas you brought with you today? Sure, I'd love to. In fact, I want you to all realize that these harmonicas all evolved from this harmonica. Now, this is a little ten-hole harmonica. So, from this harmonica, these other harmonicas came from it. This is the world's largest harmonica. This is called a 48-chord harmonica. So you have 48 chords that you can play on it. You kind of hold it like this. And you bring it up to your mouth, and this is what it sounds like. Now, this harmonica is used for rhythm. Got a nice big sound yeah. to it, doesn't it? Okay. And then this harmonica, this is called the bass harmonica. Actually, it's double bass because we've got two rows. Now, the reeds on this harmonica are so big that you can only blow on the harmonica. You could not draw the air in to make the reeds vibrate because they're so big and thick. And this is what this sounds like. <laughs> You hear that bass? Very low. All right, yes. Now, we have this harmonica, and what this does is just add effects, like somebody falling uh, uh, down some stairs or going up uh, a rope. <laughs> <laughs> and then we have the favorite of everyone. This is the world's smallest harmonica. It's called the Little Lady. And this harmonica was the first instrument ever played out in space. I'll play a little song here for you. Bobby Joe for sharing your harmonica collection with us. Well, thank you for inviting me on your show. We enjoyed it a lot. And remember, kids, we'll have more fascinating guests on the next Question Time. That went very well. Are you guys all set up for the next segment? Of course we are, boss. We're a tight team in here. <laughs> Just what I like to hear. Cue the host. For what? Sorry, Sarah, I should have told you. My mistake. We're moving on to Billy and Ruby sing-along. Oh, okay. Host, sing along next, and cue. 
All of us here in the studio love to get up and sing and dance. And now's the time, because we're going over to the dance studio for Billy and Ruby Sing and Play Along. I love to go camping. Yep, set up my tent, get out the marshmallows, and sing some songs. Today we're heading to a beautiful campsite, and we're going to sing along with a big group of kids' songs campers. Let's do it! 99 bottles of pop on the wall, 99 bottles of pop. If one of those bottles should happen to fall, 98 bottles of pop on the wall, 98 bottles of pop on the wall, 98 bottles of pop. If one of those bottles should happen to fall, 97 bottles of pop on the wall. Whoa, good thing we stopped that song to go on forever! All around the cobbler's bench, the monkey chased the weasel, the monkey thought it was all in fun. That's right, and we're ready to roll it. So cue the host. Are you feeling happy today? Good. Then stomp your feet and clap your hands along with the Kid Songs Clowns in this next video. It's if you're happy and you know it. If you're happy and you know it, clap your hands. If you're happy and you know it, clap your hands. If you're happy and you know it, then your face will surely show it. If you're happy and you know it, clap your hands. If you're happy and you know it, pull your ear. If you're happy and you know it, pull your ear. If you're happy and you know it, then your face will surely show it. If you're happy and you know it, pull your ear. If you're happy and you know it, raise your hand. If you're happy and you know it, raise your hand. If you're happy and you know it, then your face will surely show it. If you're happy and you know it, raise your hand. If you're happy and you know it, make a smile. If you're happy and you know it, make a smile. If you're happy and you know it, then your face will surely show it. If you're happy and you know it, make a smile. If you're happy and you know it, raise your hand. If you're happy and you know it, pull your ear. If you're happy and you know it, clap your hands. Well, kiddos, that's all we have time for on this episode of the Kid Songs TV Show. The one and only show made by kids, for kids, and starring kids, and big See ya! See ya!